I have Chromecast set up all throughout the house. And at the extremes of the house, I've encountered some minor issues. Here we're in a far end of the house. This is a bedroom. And uh, as you can see, I am getting uh, the Chromecast window. And uh, it does work here. But I do have issues where it will lock up at times because of the distance from the router. A second situation I have, which is not in this case, but in another section where I have it hooked into an AV setting, uh, the wiring from the receiver was causing interference. So this solution has worked in both situations. I will give you a quick rundown on it and Maybe it'll work for you, okay? So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get an HDMI extension cable, okay? You have a male on one end, female on the other, okay? And what we're going to do is pull the uh, Chromecast from the back of the TV and hook it up closer to the router. And sometimes just a couple feet can make a difference. And in this case, I will probably be moving the power supply with it, okay? Be back in a minute. Okay, so I've now unplugged the Chromecast from the TV, plugged in the extension cable, which is coming out the side, and simply ran it down here. And there we have our Chromecast. And to make it a little easier, we now have the power supply plugged in another area. Now, obviously, I used a cable that I thought would be adequate here. Uh, you may need a longer cable. They come in all different sizes. Uh, you could probably use more than one, but you know we have a nice uh, picture again, and this worked. This will just be tucked under this radiator in this case, so it'll be out of sight and out of mind. So even the wife shouldn't complain. Now in this other case, I have a Yamaha receiver here, and I had the Chromecast plugged in the back of it. Now, if your AV system is like most, or definitely like mine, you have a rat's nest of wires back there, and the Chromecast seems to be very susceptible to uh, the issue of interference and shielding that the wires may create, so the signal from the router gets interrupted. So I did the same thing here, ran the Chromecast on an extension cable, and parked it right up here on top of the cabinet. So now, not only is the interference out of the way and I have a more dependable signal, but if I have to reset it, I can get to it without moving the receiver and having to deal with all the crap of trying to get behind it to get through all the wires to push the little button on the Chromecast. So now it's easily accessible and barely noticeable just neatly tucked in there. Okay, there you go.